What's good, everybody? It's your boy, Anonymous, the author, a.k.a. Anonymous Rap Guy, and I am back with another music review and reaction, man. Today, we got a new track by a new artist, man, Song Pinky. Name of the track is Shut Up. I'm actually excited to get into it because this will be the first time I'm actually reacting to a Vietnamese artist on the channel. Um, if you are not aware, I do not speak Vietnamese, so <laughs> this will be a very interesting reaction. Really just going in for vibes, energy, you know, flow, all that good stuff that goes into a, a dope song that makes the music universal regardless of the language so uh because i still listen to daddy yankee i still listen to uh you know international artists obviously bts uh but that's for another day anyway man are uh, we just gonna skip the intro we're gonna skip all that we're just gonna get right into the music man and uh definitely catch the vibe so y'all know my bar um if it's dope i'll subscribe if it's not i won't so we'll see how good it is we'll see how awesome and fantastic the track is or if it's a downer let's just get into it First of all, starting with a dragon is already going to win me over. Okay. First off, love the bass, a uh, lot of energy that the track is starting with. It's just a little low. I don't know if it's coming through low on the speakers here. Would this be V-pop? It almost gives me like a uh, a K-pop vibe in a way. I mean, obviously it's not as poppy. This is definitely more cerebral and uh, a little deeper, but I really like it. Hey. Hey. Hearing that bass, that little beat drop, this is like an eerie. I do like the video. It gives it like an eerie, almost like a House of Usher kind of feel to it. If you haven't watched that, check that out on Netflix. Uh, this is a very cool song, man. I love the eeriness. I love the darkness of the video itself. Even though it is just a visualizer, I'm sure this could make its way easily into like a music video type thing. So it's pretty good. <laughs> Nice beat change up. Yeah, man, I mean, this is smooth. Like I say, the flow over this beat is very effortless. That's the first thing you listen to is just to make sure those two things match up. Even in another language where I'm not sure of the intricacies of the language, you can tell that he definitely has a cadence over the beat, which makes it easy to listen to music for me. So get low, shut down. Cho em băng ngon lửa hạt thù Nhốt em trong góc tối mục tù Để con tim chìm đắm trong điêu linh đốt cháy yêu thương Hòa kiếp thân cho tàn Shut up and listen to me that right there that breakdown right there reminds me of like some Edgar Allan Poe some just weird Stephen King otherworldly stuff I like that part just the small just the change up with just the instrumental it gives it a little atmosphere it gives the song a little body sorry about that i have no idea what happened to my internet so we're just gonna keep rocking out with the track man Shut up and listen to me 
As I was saying earlier, this is my first like V pop, I guess. I heard of K pop, I heard of C pop, I heard of you know, all the pops. I've never actually listened to a V pop artist before, so shouts out to you, sir. Even if you don't classify yourself that, I still like the music. <laughs> Shut up and listen to me. That breakdown is clean. That's cool. That's clean. This, this visualizer is off the chain, man. Yo, okay. He got that one. He got that one. Like and subscribe. That was dope. Yeah, got to show some love on that one, man. That was really cool. Uh, so other than the fact that my internet going out and uh, that totally sucking, uh, it was actually a very awesome song to listen to, man. Like I said, first actual... it's e The best thing about K-pop and C-pop and all that other stuff is that it actually incorporates some English. <clears throat> so it's very easy to listen to coming from a uh, native English speaker. So it just makes the song dope. It gives it like a hip-hop, K-pop, kind of a hybrid of a bunch of different genres man love the beat love the bass love the energy love the vocals um everything was easy to listen to the production was fantastic sometimes when you um you're not sure you're like oh this might just be another track but hey i love the cleanness of the vocals love the record and love the seriousness that he took uh with his his talent man like that's that's dedication especially that visualizer i know how much those things cost and i know that wasn't cheap to <laughs> so it's definitely some production going on in the background it's, it's very awesome it makes the music uh even more enjoyable when you know the artist takes it serious so make sure you check them out man down in the link in the description is the original track let them know where you heard it first man click like subscribe all that good stuff i appreciate y'all and i catch y'all next time peace